Well, the remains of those two Bahamian men whose bodies were pulled from a river in Italy arrived back in the capital this afternoon. Family members of the victims gathered at the Linden Pinling International Airport alongside foreign affairs officials for the emotional return home. A somber moment here at the Linden Pinling International Airport as family members witnessed the arrival of the remains of Alway Ramsey and Blair John. The bodies of 29-year-old Alway Ramsey and 28-year-old Blair John were flown to the capital, arriving late this afternoon on board British Airways Flight 253 from Heathrow International Airport. The bodies of the deceased were accompanied by the Director General of Foreign Affairs. Family members and officials of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs were gripped with emotions. It's been several weeks since this tragedy grabbed national headlines. The two bodies were recovered and pulled from the Po River in Turin, Italy. Minister of Foreign Affairs, the Honorable Darren Henfield, says the transition marks the first phase of the healing process for the nation. We've been dealing with this ordeal of the loss of these two Bahamian young men in Turin, Italy, since the beginning of the week, the beginning of the month, I'm sorry. And today uh, marks, in my mind, the first phase of, of this event with their repatriation to the Bahamas. We have been personally involved with the families since day one. And we're happy to have them here today at the VIP lounge in the Ministry of Foreign Affairs so that they can witness the removal of the bodies um, and be a part of, of what I think is, is, is part of the healing process for the families and for the country. The minister is encouraging the nation to pray for the families of the victims during this difficult period. After an hour at the VIP section of the Linden Pending International Airport, family members of the victims and officials of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs were then transported to the Bahamas Customs Air Freight Facility where the bodies of the victims were put into hearses and transported to Bethel Brothers Morticians. Family members of the two victims believe the arrival of their remains here at the Linden Pending International Airport will bring some closure to this tragic ordeal. Funeral arrangements for both victims have already begun. Here at the Linden Pending International Airport, Desmond Saunders, ZNS Network News.